our health system science and interprofessional practice domain will help our students emerge with a much better understanding of how health care is delivered so they can work proactively to improve the health of their patients and communities. It's not enough anymore to know about basic science and clinical science. We really need to understand how physicians contribute to improving the health of the communities that they serve. And that's what HSSIP is all about. Health system science and interprofessional practice is that critical part of the curriculum that allows our learners to develop the skills and I, perhaps more importantly the identity as a system citizen to meet the needs of people, to transition into the residency, to develop those skills that patients need in clinics and in that hospital system. In the clinical years, they're moving into their clerkships, working with patients, and that's where they really start to get to see health system science in action. For every patient they see, it's not just the individual care they provide in that moment, but it's this whole ecosystem of factors of how the health care system operates, how people are able to work within a team, what are the social determinants of health for that patient or that community. It's going to add an additional dimension of advocacy, of knowledge, of skills that will help you navigate the system on behalf of your patients to be their best advocate. Understanding how equity impacts everything that we do and how we deliver care. And it's been really exciting to me to see our learners really get engaged in the concept of health equity and again learning what they can do to make a difference. Coming into medical school, I knew there were inequalities, I knew there were disparities, but health system science really taught me the barriers to healthcare and the social determinants of health on a deeper level that solidified my passion for being a patient advocate. This health system science curriculum really teaches you to see the human being that's in front of you and the various institutional forces, um, racial, ethnic, uh, environmental influences that could be impacting their health and the things that they're coming in to see you for and get advice on. One of our most distinctive things that we do in our curriculum is the creation of the health system science champions that bring health system science principles to life in the context of our clinical clerkships. We were so fortunate to be able to recruit one clinical faculty member from each core clerkship to really help support what we do across all of the phases. The students will work with the clinical champions to take all of the principles and knowledge that they gained in phase one and then apply this in their clerkships and their fourth year. Many of the most challenging things that I cover as a practicing physician on a daily basis are related more to the topics that we cover in health system sciences than perhaps the topics that we cover in the basic or clinical sciences. Bringing in clinical champions from all of the subspecialties I think will really drive home for our students how important this is in their daily lives once they become practicing physicians in the future. The opportunity to get engaged in research around this topic is something that differentiates VTC SOM from other medical schools. We have a number of different projects that students can engage in from public health to implementation science, and the students will have the opportunity to join a lab and really better understand how evidence-based best practices make it into day-to-day -day work within the healthcare team. The expertise that we have in-house to help students get the right education around these topics as well as to be able to engage in research around these topics, in my opinion, obviously I'm biased, is unparalleled. Students are extremely lucky to be around such a great community of practice, of educators and leaders who are fully invested in this. We're going to produce better physicians who can really contribute working in teams to improving the health of the communities that they serve. And not only is that good for patient care and the patient outcomes, but also good for them and their careers and how they're able to move through and sustain their careers over the long haul. For me, HSSIP was a breath of fresh air and it really tied back in the patient aspect of medicine. I think that was really important for me to keep bringing back the idea of why I'm doing this. The biggest blessing of going through the health system science curriculum is reminding us that the people in front of us are not just patients, they're human beings and their life experiences and their humanity is what really deserves to be at the forefront of our attention.